Live and local, Terry Allen's Guitar Bar in the studio with the man himself, hey. the legend, Terry Allen. What's going hey, on? Terry, I'm so glad to finally have you back in the studio, man. Yeah, it's been it's, a while. It's probably been close to six. Well, let me think. It was, um, was it around Thanksgiving? Because I think that you and Jonna were both in here and you, you did a little Thanksgiving message for your mama. So that's been that's quite right. a while. Yeah, it was. A long time ago. So, um I'm glad that you're back in the studio. So much going on. I mean, you guys, of course, staying very, very busy. The bar um, is staying very busy. Lots of music, lots of uh, changes uh, on the horizon for Guitar Bar. Yeah, definitely. We're excited about this. I know that uh, we've talked about this for a little while, but I mean, it looks like it's really going to happen now where we're going to be able to expand the bar to the north. Right. Um, and, and move some of the pool tables and some of the games and, and stuff into that area, which will uh, then give more seating in the bar. More Are we going to expand the dance floor, too, maybe? Yeah, I'll probably make the dance floor a little like bit bigger. Like another, another couple of feet. Yeah, I mean, so that that really is just great for people who like to be able to, to come in and sit down. I know that that's been a challenge for you almost since day one, yeah. that there's not enough places for people to sit. Now, I don't know about you, but I like to sit down when I listen to my country music. Yeah. <laughs> See, if you're like me, though, you call ahead and you say, uh, I need my table. <laughs> <laughs> Hold we, my table. We have Jerry Jerry and Jonna's table right inside the front door. So uh, if you're like me, that's how you get a seat. Uh, but but for the rest of us, we're anxiously awaiting for this to happen. Any any idea, any time frame on that, Terry? Oh, not totally for sure exactly when we'll be all finished with it. But, you know, a couple months. Well, that's not bad at all. I know that you've kind of done a, something a little different with the music schedule, too. A lot more acoustic music, and I, I really like that, too. It seems like a, a good spring kind of feeling, you know, where it's a, a little friendlier. Does that make sense? Yeah, it's a, it's a little I mean, more personable. and Yeah, I think so, too. I mean, I, I think that that works so well for spring and summer mm-hmm. um, where you're playing. It's like you're playing outside. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I know that that's something that we talked about, too. You know, when we do some of this renovation, I say we because I really kind of take ownership of this bar like it's my <laughs> very own. Um, but when we do this expansion, we're talking, too, about fixing up the patio because right. what a perfect night to sit there with that door open and mm-hmm. listen to that music out on the patio. That sounds like a good time, too. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. We're absolutely. excited to get it done, so hopefully we'll get get on that and get it finished quick. Yeah, well, I hope so, too. I know that uh, that you've been playing at the bar a lot yourself, which is kind of nice. You know what? I think the very first part of the year when we talked to you, you were so busy that you had no time to play, and, and I kept complaining about that. So now I'm really glad because you're you're actually there quite a bit, and I love that. The, the night that uh, we've got some of the music on here, you're actually playing uh, with one of my favorite people in the world. Uh, Colton Burris is, yes. is going to be uh, on with us on the show tonight, and I'm excited about that. I think we're probably going to play a couple of your songs from that night, a couple of the songs that we just, you know, some Terry Allen favorites that, that we like to play here on the show. Um, we have so many people that listen to the show that, that comment all the time about how um, when I'm talking to the, the artists that are in the studio that it's just like, in your living room and it really is kind of like that i mean this is the you know we grab a guitar and and then just play and and play around i know uh some of our favorite people the um alan biffle band same thing i mean it's almost like just like everybody's family now you right. know i i, I kind of feel you know because your sister's my best friend i kind of feel like we're family anyway so right. so that works out really well <laughs> um i always get to pick which songs are my favorite so that <laughs> That works well for me, Terry. I'm not sure how that's working for you, but I, I do absolutely adore the fact that when I'm there, and I should play this. I should play on this uh, this little piece of music where you say, "Did Jerry Anderson make it in here yet?" And I wasn't. <laughs> Whoops, sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> but when you do see me, you always play my favorite stuff, and yeah. I love that. I know you. Ha- I know you have other people that like the same songs too. But I, I want you to know that I appreciate that. That just makes yeah. me feel really special. And you promote this show from the stage all the time too. And I and I really appreciate that. Yeah. I think that uh, it's getting a, a quite a following. So yeah, well we love K Law. I'm glad. Well, thank you. We love you too, Terry. In fact, you know we talk about this all the time. I, I'd love to do something where we could get some of our listeners down there and maybe do like a, a Sunday Fun Day kind of thing mm-hmm. where it's a, a K Law VIP thing or right. something like that. I need to to work out some details with you. So we could could make something like that happen. I know that that would be really, really cool. 
Uh, my daughter was telling me, too. She said, Mom, you think Terry would let us use his place for a, a stop on a poker run? I said, I'm betting that he would. <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah. you just have to ask, and, and I'm sure that that would happen. So uh, tell me a little bit about uh, this guy that's in the studio with us, Colton. I know he's been hanging around there a long, long time, and I'm yeah, glad that we're finally getting him in the studio. He's been around. <laughs> I, I get him up on stage every so often. He'll come in and well, do some Well, you know, we were teasing about this before you got here tonight. Uh, I said, yeah, I said, Terry, we'll always drag you up on stage to play one song for sure because you know i always want to hear it and you've made a habit of not learning the words to it (laughs) i think you know the words i think that you would just rather colton do it for you am i right that's right well we're going to hear that one from colton a little bit later on first we're going to hear another one that that you play for me all the time in fact sometimes you have uh mike webb singing on this song with you too right um, I, I know Kelly Walker sings it with you sometime when he's in the bar as well. And that's uh, one of my favorites. Please come to Boston. It's live and local. Terry Allen's Guitar Bar on K-Law 101. Hello, Clay Cummings. I see you decided to come out and pick with us tonight. <laughs> Please come to Boston for springtime. Staying here with some friends and they got lots of room You can sell your paintings on the sidewalk By a cafe where I hope to be working soon But please come to Boston, she said no Terry, you come home Hey, Ramblin' boy, why don't you settle down? Cause Boston ain't your kind of town. There ain't no cold and there ain't nobody like me. But I'm the number one fan of the man in Tennessee. Please come to Denver with the snowfall. Move up into the mountains so high that we can be found. And though I lust use echo down the canyons, and will I awake at night till they come back around? And please come to Denver, she said no. T. Dizzle, you come home to me. Ramblin' boy, why don't you settle down? Denver ain't your kind of town. There ain't no cold and there ain't nobody like me. Cause I'm a number one fan of the man in Tennessee. And now this drifter's world goes round and round and I doubt if it's ever gonna stop. But of all lost and found and all that I ain't got I need someone to cling to somebody I can sing to please come to LA we'll live forever the California life alone is just too hard to build I live in a house that looks out over the ocean And there were stars that fell from the sky Living upon the hill Please come to L.A. She said, no, Madison, you come home to me And hey, Brandon, boy, why don't you settle down Denver ain't your kind of town There ain't no gold and there ain't nobody like me Yeah, cause I'm the number one fan of the man in Tennessee Cause I'm the number one fan of the man in Tennessee Please come to Lawton for the springtime Oh, 
on. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very good. It was just another story printed on the second page Underneath the Tigers football score It said he was only 18, a boy about my age They found him face down on his bedroom There'll be services on Friday at the Lawrence Funeral Home. Out on Mooresville Highway, they'll lay them neath the stone. How do you get that lonely? How do you hurt that bad? Make you make a call that having no life at all is better than the life that you had. How do you feel so empty? You wanna let it all go? How do you get? Did his girlfriend break up with him? Did he buy or steal that gun? Did he lose a fight with drugs or alcohol? Did his mom and daddy forget to say I love you, son? No one see the writing on the wall I'm not blaming anybody We all do the best we can Hindsight's 2020. I still don't understand How do you get that long? It was just another story printed on the second page underneath the Tigers football score. Honey, I hope you understand We're both 
If you get the 